Chapter 31 Silver Moon Sea Silver Moon City, a huge city by the sea, to the northeast of the city was the vast ocean. Gilhai and his group left the city and flew quickly towards this vast sea in a flying boat. On the deck, Gu Hai, Shang Wan Trace, Long Wan Ching, and Grandmaster Liu Nian revealed a look of concentration, while Mu Chun Feng was puzzled at the side. Are we going to the Silver Moon Sea? Mu Chun Feng said curiously. There are still a few days left before the King Granting Conference, so we're going so we can scout the terrain, Gu Hai said with a smile. That's also true, Mu Chun Feng nodded. The flying boat was very fast and soon arrived at a huge sea area. In the four directions of the sea, there were some islands. It's over there, the Silver Moon Sea, the Silver Moon Villa's sealed sea. Long Wanqing pointed at a sea far away and said. The crowd looked down. At this moment, there were already a large number of sea ships coming to the sea as well, and some cultivators were even riding immortal cranes in the midst of flying around. Erm, there are already a lot of people coming. Mu Chen Feng was slightly stunned. They should all be Silver Moon City's cultivators, hearing that the harp granting conference is being held here. They have come to watch, and the number of people around here are already in the thousands. I think that not only those who have obtained the qualification post have come, but many of those who can't obtain the qualification post have also come to watch. Perhaps there are unexpected rewards, Long Wanqing frowned. Gu Hai nodded. These days I went through the history of Silver Moon Villa. Silver Moon Villa was not in the city in the beginning, but it was just in this sea. In the past, the founder of Silver Moon Villa, the Silver Moon was in charge of this Silver Moon Sea. At that time, countless islands in this sea were lined with buildings, and there was a great deal of people's voices. It was just that later on, they relocated to the land, and following that, a city slowly rose up from the ground. Guhai said in a deep voice. Master Liu Nian nodded and said, Not bad, the Silver Moon Sea area is actually not big. To put it mildly, it's similar to your nine, five island, although the Silver Moon Villa moved into the land. But the palace here has remained unchanged, in the north of the Silver Moon Sea, a Silver Moon Island. I heard that this is the place where my Silver Moon attained enlightenment, and all Silver Moon Villa disciples come here to cast their first zither. The northern district of the Silver Moon Sea, Silver Moon Island. What about the southern district? Gu Hai looked towards Master Liu Nian. The southern district, the southern district has a group of small islands, but it's just small islands, and Silver Moon Villa has never bothered to manage them, Grandmaster Liu Nian explained. Oh, Gu Hai looked at Shang Wan Trace. Shang Wan Trace said with a slight burst of bitter smile, some days ago, we just arrived at the southern district. We originally thought that there was no obstruction, but as a result, we all thought wrong. The flying boat, under Long Wanqing's command, slowly flew to the southern district of the Silver Moon Sea. Flying very high and hidden between the clouds, there were no more cultivators coming from this place. The cultivators who came for the King Granting Conference all went to the northern district near the Silver Moon Island. Your Majesty, look, there are three small islands in the shape of zigzags there. Shang Wen Trace frowned as he pointed at the islands below. When Gu Hai looked, there were indeed three small islands, which were currently shrouded in clouds and mist, making it impossible to see the interior in general. Originally, Master Lionian and I thought that this was an ordinary deserted island, but when we got close, we realized that this is not a deserted island. On these three small islands, there are a large number of armies stationed, and Master Lionian said that this is City Lord He's subordinate army. Shang Wen Trace frowned. Oh, Gu Hai looked towards Master Liu Nian. Master Liu Nian gave a slight burst of bitter smile and said, Back then, Long Xiaoyu had countless people pursuing her, including poor monks, including the Tishi Kong, for the contenders. I will naturally study them, and that army I'm sure is Tishi Kong's cronies. Gu Hai nodded, Newt. Steeply, 
An immortal crane carrying a cultivator flew over the place. Shoo! Steeply, three sharp arrows shot out from above one of the small islands. Now, the immortal crane let out a miserable cry and was instantly shot on the spot. What? The person on the immortal crane now to shriek at once. Take it down, a group of immortal cranes immediately rushed out from the island, carrying a dozen or so generals up into the sky. What? Who are you people? I'm just passing through. The man screamed in shock and crashed down. The immortal cranes were shot dead, and he hadn't reached the Yuanying realm yet, so he could only fall and escape. In panic, he was going to drill into the sea below, preparing to dive away. Arm. At the center of the three islands, a huge white dragon head suddenly rushed out. Suddenly, the falling cultivator was swallowed by the dragon head in one gulp. All around, the generals riding immortal cranes saw the matter settled and quickly flew back to the three islands as well. Hiss. How could this happen? How could he Shikong's army hurt the innocent? Just passing by, they're going to drive them to extinction. Mu Chen Feng was surprised. It really is the Sin Dragon. Long Wan Ching's eyes narrowed slightly. After Master Lion Yun and I saw the army, we quietly sneaked into the sea. But just after we entered the sea, we were discovered by the Sin Dragon inside. Luckily with Master Lion Yun, we escaped. Chang Wan Trace said with an ugly face. What are you guys doing here? Mu Chen Feng stared in surprise. Chang Wan Trace. However, ignored it and instead looked towards Gu Hai Dao. Your Majesty, I sense that it's right here. That's right. Does this snake head have any use? Gu Hai asked with a frown. Hishi Kong's army was stationed here, and King Liu Yang's sinful dragon was guarding it. What exactly was down here? Just for the snake head. The snake head is poisonous and can melt most seals. Shang Wen Trace explained. A. Hey, what snake head? that can dissolve seals, on the side. Mu Chin Feng stared in disbelief. Long Wan Ching and Grandmaster Liu Nian, however, knew that it was the snake head of the Zhuan Wu Supreme. But as to why Shang Wen Scar wanted it, the two of them did not know. The flying boat is hidden between the white clouds. The garrison on the three islands below does not know, but below in the deep sea, beyond a huge sea valley, Dozens of 500 feet long giant dragons were hovering at the moment, and on top of the head of each of the long dragons, there was a meter seal sin pattern. One of the largest black dragons of 800 feet was originally hovering above a huge rock on the seabed, squinting and resting. Steeply, the black dragon's eyes opened, the surrounding water lines abruptly fluctuated. Oh, it's here again. HMPH. The black dragon's eyes narrowed in a cold voice. You three, follow me. The black giant dragon said in a cold voice. Boom. The four giant dragons steeply dashed straight towards the sea, carrying a ferocious aura up into the sky. High above the sea. Mu Chen Feng stared blankly at Gu Hai. Gu Hai, what's going on? Aren't we scouting the road for the King Granting Conference? What's going on with this snake head? And the Sin Dragon, why do I get the feeling that you guys came here for some crappy snakehead? Gu Hai ignored Mu Chen Feng and instead looked at the surrounding sea and frowned, perhaps. This King Granting Conference isn't that simple. Oh, Mu Chen Feng said blankly. Master Liu Nian nodded and said, Not bad. The King Granting Conference, not choosing any other place, but choosing this sea. The old mana master just have ulterior motives. Perhaps, Gu Hai frowned and looked at the sea below. Steeply, the sea surface churned. A. Gu Hai's face changed. Boom. Steeply, a black shadow rushed up into the sky, coming straight at the flying boat. A huge black shadow, carrying a huge momentum, falling a huge storm, coming straight up at the flying boat. Not good. It's the Sin Dragon. Master Liu Nian's face changed. Arm. A dragon's roar rang out, and steeply a tail blasted above the flying boat. Buzz! Above the flying boat, countless formations suddenly emerged, but even so, 
the force of the dragon's tail was too great, and in an instant, the flying boat was flung into the distance. Ah, Mu Chen Feng's face changed wildly. Gu Hai and Shang Wen Scar quickly grabbed the railing. Long Wan Ching steadied herself. Master Liu Nian instantly rushed out of the grand formation and struck a palm towards the dragon's body. Since, under the huge palm, the dragon's tail trembled slightly, but it didn't hurt too much. Boom! The flying boat was flung on top of the sea not far away, and immediately, the three sinful dragons broke through the sea and wrapped the flying boat. Master Quicksilver stood before the flying boat and looked at the largest black dragon in surprise. Ghost Face, Guhai's face sank. Ghost Face, last time in the North Sea, the group of dragons surrounded the Zhuang Wu. Ghost Face was the leader of the group of dragons and fought with Mao Chen for a period of time. And when he was about to leave, young Master Un called out its name. Who did I think it was? So it's Master Lionian, and this group of One Piece Hall congregation. Ghost Face revealed a cold smile and said, The huge dragon head revealed a hideousness. Although the flying boat was big, the giant dragon body was also huge and incomparable. The four giant dragons trapped the flying boat in the center, blocking all paths. Sin Dragon Ghost Face, you dare to attack my flying boat? Do you want to rebel? Long Wan Ching's eyes glared and said, Ha 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 ha. Rebellion. Hall Master Long. You have overstated your words. How could I rebel? It's just a personal grudge. Don't rise that high. Besides, Silver Moon Sea. You shouldn't have come. If you come, you won't be able to leave. Ghost face sneered. Ong, ong, ong. The other three giant dragons let out a roar. And steeply, the sky was covered in dark clouds, and as soon as the heavenly phase came out, rolling torrential rain poured down, and suddenly, the sky was dark. Mu Chen Feng's face changed furiously as he said in horror, How could this happen? Why are you guys besieging us? We were just passing through. Rudder Master Mu, it seems that my guess has come true. The Silver Moon Sea is indeed a trouble. Gu Hai laughed bitterly from the side. Buzz, Master Lunian probed his hand and waved, and instantly, the 18 Buddha beads instantly grew larger, as if 18 mound giant mountains surrounded the perimeter. Gu Hai, Hall Master, you guys go first, I'll stop them, Master Lunian called out. Good, Long Wan Ching nodded in response. The Buddha sea is boundless, Master Liu Nian waved his right hand. Buzz, the 18 giant mountains of Buddha beads carried a monstrous and ferocious momentum as they crashed towards the four giant dragons. HMPH, Master Liu Nian, I've heard of your great name long ago. Unfortunately, you're just like me. You're only in the Yuanin realm. It's enough for me to stop you. You guys take down this flying boat for me. Ang, ghost face let out a roar. Boom. Between the dragon's tail flinging, the sky was suddenly filled with 18 thunderbolts that followed its orders and charged towards the 18 Buddha beads. Ghost face lunged straight at Master Liu Nian. Maneuver the flying boat and go, Long Wan Ching called out. Right at this moment, a red dragon's tail, in an instant, wrapped around and entangled the flying boat formation, making it impossible for the flying boat to leave. Ang. The three dragon heads instantly spat out ice cone storms in their mouths in general, crashing into the formation on the flying boat. Rumble. The flying boat formation shook violently and, being pulled by the red dragon, the entire flying boat was instantly dragged to the bottom of the sea.